couple of weeks, we have learned how to pronounce certain words. For instance, you say thank you and not thank you or archbishop, not archbishop. And it's all because of a man who hails from Kisumu County and has rightfully claimed the word title word master. Willis, good evening. <laughs> Good evening, Betty. How is Nairobi? We are fine. Thank you very much, Willis. Now, let's get straight to it. Do we say tyranny of numbers or is it tyranny of numbers? <laughs> Betty, we say tyranny. Tyranny of numbers, not tyranny. We say tyrannical. Tyrannical and we also have tyrannized. Tyrannized. But when we are talking about the person, we say tyrant a tyrant. Mm -hmm. So that glide I is only used when we're referring to the person tyrant. But the word is tyranny. Very well, Willis. Now, do we say she loves to comb her hair or she loves to comb her hair? Yeah. Betty, we say comb. Comb. B is silent. Just like we say bomb, not bomb. We also talk about bombers. Bombers, the bombers, not the bombers. We don't have a digraph in that case. B is silent. So, comb. To comb the hair. To climb a tree. Climb, not climb. A climber, not climber. <laughs> a climber. Willis, you never cease to amaze. Now, moving on, do we say many Kenyans are living below the poverty line or poverty line? Betty, we say poverty. The sound value is O, not A. O, poverty line. All right. Um, do we say a sachet of tea leaves or a sachet of uh, tea leaves or sugar? Sachet. 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 We say sachet. That is a word which is of French origin. So C and H form the sound sh and not ch in that case. All right. Is it, is, is it right to say the children recited the Apostles' Creed or Apostles' Creed? This word, Betty, we say Apostle. Apostle, T is silent. Okay. But when we change that word, we are talking about inflection, that is, changing the form of a word for grammatical function, we say apostolic, that is the adjective, apostolic. But the person is an apostle, apostle. Does it go for or pestle and mortar, pestle or pestle? Pestle, we say pestle. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, is this sentence correct? He put my life in jeopardy or jeopardy? <laughs> that word, Betty, we say je jeopardy. O is silent. We say jeopardy not jeopardy, which is very common. Most people mistake that the word is pronounced as jeopardy, but there is no vowel glide in that word. We say jeopardy, jeopardize, and we also say leopard, not leopard, as we commonly oh. mistake. Similarly, we say Leonard, Leonard, not Leonard. O is silent. So, Willis, last week we spoke about archbishop and not archbishop. Does that apply to words like architecture? No, we say architecture, not architecture. <laughs> what I explained last week, my dear sister, is when we use A-R-C-H as a combining form to mean main or most important, we say arch, archbishop, archdiocese, arch enemy, arch rival. But in this case, we say architecture, architect, we say archive, archaeology or archipelago, not arch in this case. All right. Well, it's always a pleasure having you. Thank you very much for your time. Well, it's the word master coming to us live from Kisumu County, teaching us how to pronounce those troublesome words. Remember, you can uh, tweet me at Betty Kialo or at Katie and Kenya. Those words that uh, give you trouble or uh, put you in embarrassing situations. This has been Mind Your Language.